I'm one of the person that will definitely promote the idea of check and balance in the government. I will definitely support the uh, intention to introduce the anti-hopping law. In fact, when we launch our state initiative in this coming election, one of the things that will be highlighted will be our willingness to introduce an anti-hopping enactment. So that alone uh, indicates how serious the state is uh, about the anti-hopping and um, the various, uh, I would say, um, consideration that has to be put in place as a state assemblyman, you know, as a law-making uh, body so that it will has got more, it has got a better, not just stability, but also reputation. You know, it's, uh, it's so important uh, for that to happen in your home. I'm one of the person that will definitely promote the idea of check and balance in the government. If there is uh, an opposition, then the opposition should remain an opposition with full credibility, an opposition that is uh, ever willing to counter, to come with a better proposition whenever they are dealing with the government proposal. So the check and balance uh, in a democratic system is very much needed in Johor when if we were to look at the uh, uh, composition of the society, the Malay, the Chinese, the Indian, it's almost well balanced. You know, it's only 55-56% Malay. So that alone requires the right number of uh, representation among all races. They have got to be um, a balanced approach in terms of providing assistance. If certain, uh, I would say, uh, exemption is given to government schools, then all the SJKT should also receive the same treatment. If this um, Rumah Ibadat Bukan Islam. If the mosque and the surau has got uh, exemption from paying uh, quit rent, then all the various uh, Rumah Ibadat Bukan Islam, they should also receive uh, a similar, uh, I would say, uh, facility. So, when I introduce uh, common the uh, peruntukan for all the adun, to me that is only a fair decision because all assemblymen is elected by, by the rakyat. So they should have a basic allocation for development purposes within their constituency, other than their own um, fundraising or their own uh, allowances. Everyone will get the same. And uh, since the government uh, uh, rep has got allocation for uh, their respective constituencies uh, development, then opposition should also receive. The same. Yes, I would. I would want that to have to continue.